Ralph is up. Ralph says, hump day questions. Okay, back to the P.O. Box question. I recently took over SEO on a client's website. They are ranking well for certain keywords using a Minneapolis address. However, the address used is a UPS store. I didn't realize this until I looked at the photos. I thought it was a P.O. Box from the U.S. Postal Service, but it is not. So what should I do? Move it over to U.S. P.O. P.S. P.O. Box? If I change the address from the UPS store to a P.O. Box in Minneapolis, will that affect our rankings? Will I be able to move the reviews along with the address? Yes. Um, okay, well, first, the first question is, what should I do? Move it? I wouldn't. I wouldn't move it if it's ranking. And if, 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 if here's the thing. If it's already ranking, there's really no reason to move it. I don't suggest creating new UPS or new Google My Business listings using UPS mailboxes because uh, Google has cracked down on that quite a bit. But if you have flown under the radio, radar this long, leave it. Don't if it ain't broke, don't fix it. You know what I mean. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't go in and mess with it as long as it's ranking. That doesn't mean that tomorrow or six months from now or two years from now, Google isn't going to come in and say it's a spam account and, and turn, you know, and and deactivate or delete that that listing, terminate the listing. But why not just cross that bridge when you come to it? I, I mean, that's what I'm saying. If it's already, if it's not ranking yet, then yeah, change it. Why not? You're, you don't have anything to lose. Right, but if it's already ranking, it's producing results for the client, then I wouldn't mess with it. Okay, just leave it alone. Um, if I change, however, if you were to change the address from the UPS store to a PO box, would the reviews move along with the address? Yes. The only time the re reviews do not move is when you delete or terminate or um, say a, 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 when you close a, a listing and then create a new listing. That's the only time that you're going to lose the reviews. It used to be when there were Google Plus pages and all that kind of stuff, there was some trickiness there where you could lose them, but now it's all done in maps. So if all you're doing is changing the address or any one of the data points, any one of the uh, you know company details, it doesn't change the listing. In other words, it's still the same company, it's still the same entity. It's just some of the details have changed. So your reviews will stay, stay in place, okay? Um, some of this may be rookie questions, but hey, I'm thankful. No, that doesn't matter, Ralph. That's what we're here for. I know uh, there was some time in the past where rookie questions may have been looked down upon <laughs> by me at some point, but that's that's no longer the case, guys. I welcome any question. We do. That's what we're here for. Okay, that's what the Hump Day Hangouts is all about. So, thanks for participating, Ralph, and hopefully that helps. I wouldn't I wouldn't mess with it. Leave it alone as if, as long as it's producing results. If it's not ranking, then sure, change it now because it could be a problem in the future it, it it may and it may always stay under the radar i just know i've had ups uh mailboxes that have had issues because of that okay